Yeah, yeah. Nice one. That's a better fish. Nice one. G'day guys, it's your boy Nat Sharky Shorten back for another episode of Fisherman's Diary. Bloody jellyfish right there. We're in Cabbage Tree Point today. Uh, ca no, Cabbage Tree Creek. And we're going to go up Nunda Creek with the tide, flick lures along the way, throw some plastics, do some trolling. See what we can't find. It's another new system I've not explored before and one that I'm pretty excited about uh, exploring. The sun is just coming up. We've got pretty much all day to do it. Hopefully we can find some fish. Goals obviously, flathead, brim, cod, um, trev, a range of things. We'll see what we can find. So let's do it. It's so fucking cold, hey. It is splitting cold. It's that cold that fucking stings the skin. Disgusting cold. Oh, that was a bump. We would definitely want to take a couple fish today to make this worth getting up this early, man. All right, the trolling has been not fruitful. The water's really clear though, so I'm thinking maybe some plastics around structure might be the angle. So we'll get down there and give that a go. Fish. Oh no. Yep. Uh, <laughs> oh boy. That is not the fish I wanted to see right now. That's awful. See you, bud. Oh. Fish? Snag. Fish. Yeah. Fish. Finally. <laughs> well, we're back to trolling, guys. We've got the spike down there. And we're on to something. It's not too bad. Yeah, it's not too bad. Brim, I would have to imagine. Nope, it's a lizard. Nice. Very good. We'll take that. There's our first. Well, it's not our first fish, I guess. Uh, I suppose you can't legally say that. I wish it was our first fish. <laughs> but no, not our first fish. Our first lizard though, and that's not a bad lizard at all. On the spike. Can't remember the name of the color, but it's like the silver, silver spike. I like to use this one when the water's a bit clearer. See, bud. Oh, yes. Ah. Hook up, hook up. That's another flathead. That's another flathead for sure. Has to be. Okay, good stuff. It's a couple of fish in a little 200 meter stretch. Not big flathead, but they are flathead and that's all we're looking for. That's our target species. There we go, boy D. See ya, boy D. Have a good one, chief. Ah, boy, oh boy. Oh, yep. Fish. Yeah. Wind into him. It's another flathead for sure. No size yet. Maybe this one's legal. Let's see. It doesn't really feel like it. <laughs> it doesn't really feel like it. He doesn't feel like a spectacular fish, but it's a fucking creek with some flathead in it at least. So that's cool. What's about this won't be a flathead? <laughs> <laughs> Lol. You, you knew that was coming though, didn't you? You knew that was coming. Okay, see you bud. Nice, good stuff. Oh, fish, yes. Yes, that is a long time in between them. <laughs> that is a fucking long time in between fish. That's like an hour at least. Oh, he's in the tree. Oh, what the fuck? Fish is in the tree, guys. How does that happen? That kind of thing's silly. No, nope, we're still on. We're just in the tree. All right, let's have a look at what we got. Come on. No, it's a brim. Yep. Brimosaurus Rex. Oh, God. Fuck, 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 fuck. Oh, he's come off it. 
there we go, that's good. What the fuck? Get off there. Get off there, there we go. Now we're cooking with gas. Now we're cooking with gas. Straight to fish. Let's go, that took a minute. <laughs> well, no lizards for a while, which is strange. I reckon now's probably a good, as good a time as any to throw a plastic on and try to flick around these boats, see if we can't find a couple more brim. Yep. Nice. Good fish. There's that brim we were just talking about. There's that brim we were just talking about. No, it's a white. <laughs> Well, that's actually a pretty nice sized whiting too. That's a really healthy whiting. Ah, they will say yes to a plastic and another common estuary species you will find throwing plastics around Brisbane Creeks. It's a very healthy whiting. See you, bud. Gotcha. Not big, just a little brim. Good to know they're out there though. Fish on the plastic, right beside the kayak. Just drop that down as a little bit of a tester. And wouldn't you know it, we do hook up. Fish, brim that time I think. Yeah, just a little fella. There had to be one in this little eddy through here though. Gotcha. Another brim. No size though. They're all really dinky brim to be honest. Surely in under this there's a fish, right? There has to be. Has to be a fish under there. I'm pretty sure, legally, it's a requirement. There had to be. There literally had to be. There literally had to be. Nice. What do we got, Brim? Yeah, nice one. There's that Brim we're talking about. That's what we're wanting. We'll cruise up a little bit out of the tide. I'm so glad that's not a dry dock. It can't be though, because it's elevated, so there'd be no reason for there to be matting underneath it. There's a nice fish. Very good. Pumpkin seed does a job. Surely fish. Surely fish. Had to be, had to be. It's a pretty good one too. Pretty good one too. Nice, solid brim. Had to be. Literally had to be. Back paddle, back paddle, back paddle, back paddle, back paddle. Yep, just in front of the pylon there. Just in front of the pylon. That's not a bad one. Oh yeah, that's a pretty solid fish. That's a nicer brim. <laughs> nice. Well, taking a few now, that's a nicer fish. That's a much nicer fish. Oh, there's one. There's one. There's one. Nice fish too. That was a good, cool eat. He swam straight under there. We tried to. Oh my God, it's gone. <laughs> Plastic no more. Plastic bye bye. <laughs> no more plastic. <laughs> there we go. Gotcha. Nice fish. See you, bud. Oh, yep. Yep. Ah. Oh, little Moises. Nice. Another one of these estuary species. Well, it's a healthy, healthy enough little system here. Um, there's plenty of species getting around. Okay. Yeah, yeah, nice one. 
That's a better fish. Nice one. Nice fish. Right on that pylon. Oh yeah. Good stuff. That was a sick eight, dude. That was a sick eight. That's got to be a nice brim. That's a beauty. Nice. Well, that's what we're looking for. That's what we're looking for. Nice. Ah, that's a beautiful fish. Nice swim. All right, right on that pylon. And uh, so often, as is the case, the brim feed right there. He smashed that pumpkin seed. <laughs> that's fucking crazy. What, what, what were you watching? Was it one around here or? River one. Yeah, right. Yeah, mad. <laughs> sick. Yeah, Nat, nice to meet you. <laughs> nice. Yeah, okay, sick. Uh, oh, sweet. What's your channel? I haven't got one up. Yeah. I'm just trying to get all the equipment. Yeah, yeah, gotcha. I've got GoPros coming next week. Yeah, nice, nice. Yeah, because I just fish land-based heaps, bro. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, when you get one, comment on the video. I'll fucking, yeah, fucking hit, up, hit the I'm sub and check you out. Shit, yeah, that's crazy, man. <laughs> uh, I'm looking at you, I was like, I'm pretty sure that's a fish. <laughs> 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 fucking wild, bro. <laughs> uh, yeah, cheers, brother. Good luck. <clears throat> Which is pretty cool. It's very humbling. It's a very humbling experience. Oh, there's a fish. There's a fish. Very humbling experience. Turn around, Jai. You missed one. What do we got? Jai said all he's caught catching was whiting. Oh, well, <laughs> He's fucking jinxed me, he has. <laughs> he's well and truly jinxed me. Tell you what, there's some chubby whiting, though. That one and the one we got earlier. They're both of them pretty, pretty sound fish. Let me see if I can bloody oh, get the hooks out of this thing. Yeah, guys, my channel's almost big enough to the point where I can start grooming, grooming kids. Because, like, all the YouTubers do that. I don't know what the actual sub count is that you've got to get to before that's, like, kind of, like, what you have to do. I don't even know if you do have to do it, but they all do it, so maybe there is a rule. But anyway, um... I'm almost there, and I, I, I mean, this is gonna sound really fucking strange, but man, I, it would be so easy for me to be a pedo, like... <laughs> I knew that would be fucked coming out of my mouth, but I, like, I didn't even fucking, I didn't expect how bad that was, but anyway, point is, I get plenty of messages from people, you know, who watch the show and stuff and they're all they're, I always appreciate messages even if I don't get to them all the time straight away or whatever it's always nice to get messages from people like oh you know even just like oh, I love the show you're sick you know people ask for hints and tips and stuff and I, I try to give them you know as much info as I kind of can um, but anyway it's pretty it's pretty common that like people message me, like bro we should go for a fish you know, and I'll have a peek at their Insta account or whatever, and they're like 10 or like 12, and it's like, man, <laughs> I can't, <laughs> like, like I, I literally can't do that, bro. I can't, as a 25-year-old man, go fishing with you, bro. It just can't happen. It's, it's gonna look so fucking bad, like, if your parents were there, that's different. Especially if, you know, you've got a single mum or something involved, then we can discuss. But, I mean, just, yeah, I, I always feel bad because it's like, I can't, I can't say, I don't want to say no because fuck you, I don't want to fish with you. But, like, I, I can't go fishing with a kid. You just can't do that. Like, <laughs> the optics of that are just not sound. So, anyway, um, I, anyway, point is, I appreciate all the messages. It's always very kind. This guy is paddling with a stick. That is fucking hard. Dude, that is badass, bro. Oh, seahawk. Big one, too. Big chunky one. Yeah, there's a fish. Yep. That might be another whiting. That might well be another whiting. This one's on the spike. Let's get a look here. It's not big, whatever it is. No, it is a flathead. Very good. That's our target species. Very good. Not a big one, but we're back where we caught the first two. So they clearly don't mind this stretch for whatever reason. Oh, fish. That's an eight. That's an eight. That's a fish. Very nice. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm just trying to keep this kayak straight. Just trying to keep this kayak straight. He's not big. Let's 
got to be a brim if he ran like that, right? Got to be a brim bull. Could be a soul, maybe? I don't know. Oh, it's a flathead. It's a, it is a floody. That's all right. Not a big one. Four lizards, none of them size. Some dink flatty getting around this creek. He is not a big flatty at all, but the fact he's here does give me a little bit of a, a little bit of hope that we might get a decent one. So we'll troll for a bit longer and see what we can see. And oh, there's one. There's a fish. That's got to be flathead too. That's got to be flathead too. And this is a good little area for them. That's two we'll pull here. It might be worth another troll. That definitely feels like flathead. I don't think it's very big, but it's bigger. It's the biggest flatty of the day, I would imagine. Let's have a look. Oh yeah, you know, he's actually a pretty nice fish. Yeah, that's a pretty nice lizard. <laughs> Yoink. We'll take that, baby. We'll take that, let's go. Well, how are we gonna do this? <laughs> I can probably swing him around the other side. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. <sighs> Let's see if we can. Oh yeah, that should work. That ought to work. That ought to work. We might get out of this tangle free. Well, this is what we wanted. We wanted to finish with a nice lizard. And he's no Hulk donkey. But that's a pretty nice flathead. We'll take it. Big time. All right, buddy. Oh, he's only just pinned. He's only just pinned. There's not a whole lot in it. He's still got some go too. He's still got some real go. Nice, well it was a good eat. I thought that had to be a pretty nice fish. And we were due a nice flatty. What, we caught four, four so far, all dinks. We were due one that was legal, at least. So we'll take that. Nice, and that'll do for you. No hog donkey. Oh, okay, okay. That was a really nice flathead to finish. He'd be... I'm not sure how big he is. I need to start measuring fish more. People ask me for measurements. I never measure them. I'm not sure. He'd be 55? A bit smaller? I'm not sure. Around the 50 centimeter mark. Flathead are a hard one because they're a really long fish. Deceptively so. Nice flatty. All right. See you, bud. Back he goes. Happy as Larry, turn the right way up. There we go. Nice lizard. Well, that's exactly how we want it to finish. My God. And it actually, in all honesty, has turned into a pretty fucking nice day of fishing. 